Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to customize your apps and how to customize your app icons without that application going through shortcuts when you click on it to open it up. Uh, so if you guys have noticed when everyone's been upgrading and updating their app icons and stuff recently, it's opened up the shortcuts application whenever you've clicked on that application that you've made. Uh, so this is going to be a way to get around that and open up the application directly rather than it opening up through shortcuts. It's actually very easy to set up. All you guys have to do is go to the comment section or in the description and you guys will see a link over to this shortcut right here called Icon Themer. You just want to go ahead and click on Get Shortcut and then it will bring you over to your shortcuts application and then we'll be able to create our new shortcut here. Uh, now, once you want to do this is you want to scroll all the way down to the bottom of this and click on add on trusted shortcut. If you don't, uh, you aren't allowed to add on trusted shortcuts, you guys can just quickly go over to your settings, over to shortcuts, and then just make sure you have the allow untrusted shortcuts turned on. Otherwise, you should be good to go. So we can just go back into shortcuts and click on add on trusted shortcut and then click on continue and done. And then if you already have it like I do, you can click replace. If you don't, then it won't come up for you, but I already had it, so that's why that came up like that. After you've done that, you wanna go over to the My Shortcuts tab at the bottom left and just click on Icon Themer. And then right away, it's gonna ask us to choose an app. Now, this only works with apps from the App Store. It does not work with system apps. The system apps will open up shortcuts to open them up. But if we get from an App Store, it will open it up right away without going through the shortcuts application, which is pretty cool. So we just click on search in App Store. And this is gonna be any application that you're looking for, any application that you want at all, uh, this will work for. So let's just say if I was gonna download Facebook, for example. I'm gonna search for Facebook or even TikTok, let's do TikTok. So to search for TikTok, click done. And then it will show you a bunch of different applications. So the one that we want is TikTok, so the top one right there. And then it's gonna ask us if we would like to allow access, we wanna click okay. And then it's gonna ask us for the icon, we can just do the default icon so it looks perfect. So I'll just click on default icon or I can click on choose from photos and choose my own icon that I want. So let's just say actually if I got my own icon, I can just click on choose icon and we'll click OK. And then let's just say I wanted this C icon right here. And then here's where we could change the label and the name of the application. So in this case, we just want to be TikTok. So we can just take out the rest of it and just leave TikTok and click on done. And then click on OK one more time. And then done. And now what it's going to do, it's going to ask us to uh, download a configuration profile. We're going to want to click on allow for that. And then it's going to say profile downloaded. So we can close out of here and we can go over to our settings. And we want to go to general. Scroll down and you'll see profiles or profiles and device management. You want to click on that. And then it says TikTok icon. We can go ahead and click on that and install at the top right. Put your passcode. And then click install at the top right one more time. And then install. Once it's done, you can click on done and we can exit out of here. And you guys have noticed there is the TikTok application that we just created. Obviously this icon is very ugly, uh, but you guys can go ahead and pick any custom icon you want. Uh, so once it's done there, you can just go ahead and click on it and you'll notice it'll open up TikTok right away without opening up the shortcuts application first. So that's very, very important guys. I'll show you guys one more time really quickly. Right away, opens up TikTok, does not go to the shortcuts application whatsoever. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to create your own applications and application icons without going through shortcuts. If this was helpful, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching.